I've actually been mocked for making beats with my mouth. I've been told that I can't glorify God with it. I've been told that I can't help people come closer to them. And so what I did is instead of screaming at them, I kept doing it. And I made really good ways of helping people acknowledge Jesus in a different way that they've never heard before. So this is what I call a joyful noise. You make a joyful noise no matter what you got. If you stream in a heavy metal band, if you do hip hop music, if you make beats on your computer, if you make fart noises with your mouth, you glorify God with everything you do. If you can sing pretty, that's what's up. I, um, so I'm just going to go for it and see what happens here. My Uncle Steve's funeral is next Saturday. I can't make it because I'm doing this. I'm at another festival. So this one goes out to him on behalf of me missing his funeral. me to take away my scars and really 
if we if we took his scars away, if that never happened, we would never have salvation through Jesus on the cross. That beautiful, wonderful cross. If you would have never hung and died on that cross, man, Jesus is so good. Today, if you're going through something rough, if you're going through something hard, if you're going through a struggle, you don't understand the answers. Your church is dying. Your family's getting broken up. You're struggling financially. You can't pay the bills. You don't like who you are. You can't accept the person in the mirror. You're your own worst enemy. I want to let you know right now, instead of questioning God, instead of yelling at Him right now, I want you to lift your voice and I want you to straight up tell Him, no matter what comes my way in this life, you're still my God. And you're beautiful. Amen. You're beautiful. Feet. 